Medellin Software Valley, the most innovative city in the world, as declared by Wall Street Journal and by Citigroup, two powerful entities from the United States of America. Medellin Metropolis is a renaissance sophisticated city. Today is the urban art city capital of the world. Medellin is urban culture at its best. Medellin is urban art. A significant part of Medellin is covered in urban street art. Many of the public streets are adorned with large mural paintings. These art paintings and murals illustrate a historical perspective of present and recent social and political events that took place during the 1980s and during the 1990s, specifically during the Orion operation. Medellin's renaissance is characterized by the new transformation in technology, in scientific and software development, such as artificial intelligence, and in the urban street art murals, as I have shown in this video. Medellin Renaissance City is now the 21st century art and sculpture capital of the world. Medellin has the best and the most sophisticated public art museum on planet Earth. There is a permanent public art museum in downtown Medellin. Actually, the art museum is located in Plaza Botero, displaying over 20 large art sculptures developed and sculptured by Master Fernando Botero. Master Fernando Botero, or Maestro Botero, is considered by the European art critics as the best art painter and best sculptor of the 21st century. These critics represent the best arts on planet Earth. Each of these sculptures permanently displayed in Plaza Botero in the city of Medellin metropolis is valued at 5 million USA dollars. That is each individual sculpture. Therefore, the public park in Medellin contains about 20 of Fernando Botero sculptures. All of these art collections are today valued at over 120 million USA dollars. Master Botero art and sculptures are characterized by the fact that all of these art collections are mainly obese paintings and sculptures. They are technically not obese, but rather voluminous. Botero voluminous art equates to the robust corruption of governments around the world, specifically governments in Latin America, but with emphasis in the governments of Colombia for the past 100 years. So, 
in the final analysis, Medellin's renaissance is the leader in technology, the leader in urban music, and the avant-garde city leader in art and sculptures and mural paintings. Medellin is the best art city on planet Earth. Medellin's Software Valley is the software artificial intelligence make of technology in the world. So, Medellin Renaissance Metropolis has European French castles and European French Eiffel Tower and European medieval castles. Medellin Renaissance Metropolis has European French castles such as Museum of or Castillo near downtown Medellin with luscious green trees and beautiful jungle-like gardens. This museum castle has was built in the 1930s. It is a Gothic French style castle nestled in the majestic emerald green and the mountains of South America. It is absolutely beautiful. Medellin Renaissance City of art has the French Tower of or, or the French Eiffel Tower nestled in the natural jungle setting of the city surrounded by modern skyscrapers located in Medellin Savaneta. Medellin Renaissance Art City is complemented by more urban street art at different geographical locations of the city of Medellin. And finally, Medellin Metropolis is the reggaeton music capital of the world. Today, the best pop artists and artists in the world who are born in the beautiful city of Medellin Metropolis, such as Maluma, winner of 10 Grammy Awards from the United States of America, J Balvin, won seven Grammys from the USA in pop music. Carol G, a famous super pop star, won seven several seven Grammy Awards from the USA. And of course, the great Juanes, who won more than 10 Grammys, is today the best solo rock artist in the world. All of these individuals, including including Fernan Maestro Fernando Botero or Master Fernando Botero, who is today the best painter, artist, and sculptor of the 21st first century, according to the European critics. All of these individuals were born in the beautiful city of Medellin and they are really 100% true Paisas of Medellin. So, in the final analysis, Medellin Software Valley is the mecca of technology in the Americas. Medellin Metropolis is magnificent urban art as illustrated in this video, Medellin is the new epicenter of art with beautiful art murals in the streets and with an amazing Botero art sculpture collection displayed out in the public to be precise in Plaza Botero Park. Medellin Metropolis 
is European medieval castle located in Valley of St. Nicholas in Llano Grande. This new European Gothic style castle is in development today and it will be an important theme park for Latin America will offer visitors a sophisticated high-end mall and many other things. This segment of the video illustrates several art paintings done by a super paisa woman who is now 98 years old. These artworks show colloquial colonial paintings of the famous Pueblito Paisa, a pe Pueblo Cafetero, a coffee bean town, an artificial intelligence artwork, and Vermont Farm, the city of Granada, Spain, and Torremolinos in the country of Spain.